Oh, do you think they're excited? Are you excited? Are you excited? Because they're excited. Are you ex <laughs> <laughs> All right, what do you think they are? What do you think they are? Which ones? These? Yeah, what, what do you think people chose? What do you think you chose? 202s. 202s? Yeah. What about the 978s? No. No? 202s. It's just a good number. Show what's up! Boom! Guys, what's up? It's Mark. Check this out. So, remember that video I did a few days ago on you choose the wheel? The time has come. You guys have chose. I actually had somebody send me, an, uh, send me an email, reach out to me like, dude, switch it up a little bit. Do something different. So, with that said, here's the wheel. We're going to do the reveal. And now it's time to do the reveal. Ready? These are the new wheels that are going on. The 2014 Silverado 1500 right here. Um, it was the between the Moto Metal 978s and the Moto Metal 202s. Ready? Check it out. Safety first. All right, ready guys, drum roll. There we go, ready, ready, what is it? What do you, so what do you guys think it is? What do you guys really think it is? The 202s with the chrome lip, or with the black lip and the chrome, no, chrome lip and the, yeah, chrome lip and the black face or the 978s, the um, all black. What do you guys think? What's that? All right, ready? Here it goes. I know you guys are excited. <laughs> and I'm not gonna lie, I'm excited too, because you know why? I'm going with my original instincts. Oh, there it is! Introducing, we're gonna flip it around. The Moto Metal 202. We're gonna put this here nicely, hopefully that don't drop it. These are a 20 by 10 wheel. Come get a close up of these, Noah. Chrome lip, black face, machined accents. Really nice wheel. Nice, nice setup right here, guys. It's gonna look nice and aggressive on this truck. I think it's gonna be a, a quite a good fit. So um, let me try to set this down. Hold on. Set it down right here. Oh, you hear that? Golly! Slide this out of the way, put that there. God, these wheels are heavy. They don't make wheels light nowadays, do they? Um, oh my God, so heavy. Shit, poor shit. So there it is. All right, get like a, get like a, a sexy photo of me like posing on it. Uh, look at me, to all, the, to all the models out there. Look at all the models. Look at me, look at me, I'm a model. Uh. Oh, no, cool. Anyways, hope you guys like the model shoot and the photo and everything. These are the chosen wheels, the Moto Metal 202s. Chrome lip, black face, machined accents. I think it's gonna look great. Hope you guys look, it's gonna look great. Hope you guys, blah, blah, blah. Hope you guys think it's gonna look great also. Um, there was a few comments, probably like two comments in there said this wheel right here. So I decided to go with it from that in the email that we sent out. And here's the back of the wheel. Check it out, Noah. It's a two-piece wheel. Really a nice setup. I think it's, I think it'll look great. And the cool part about these guys is you can, a lot of people don't know this, you can, you can, you know, kind of do your own twist on too. I have a buddy of mine that actually has a Jeep that they took apart the wheel and they powder coated the wheel. It's actually, that's funny because that's what he suggested I do with this truck, but I'm gonna leave that up to you guys, whoever buys the truck. Driving by your 6.7 liter Cummins turbo diesel with a full four inch exhaust and an SB air intake. Appreciate it. Doing a video. People, I'll tell you. But so you can take off this wheel and leave the lip chrome or paint the lip and leave the wheel face black. There's a whole, there's unlimited options with a two piece wheel. Um, so hope you guys like the video and we'll see how that looks here in about 30 minutes after I get back from the bar. And they're done mounting these wheels and tires. Peace out. This is Mark signing out. Keep the video for like three seconds after you zoom in.